Hi guys, welcome back. This is my fifth book today. And today, we are going to be reading... Sorry, I sound weird. And today, we're going to be reading... Someone who worried a lot that came to not worrying. And just worrying just a little bit. Like, worrying the time that she needs to worry. She's a girl, and she worries all the time. Then she worries. She doesn't worry anymore. And she doesn't worry that much anymore. So, let's see what the book is. And today we're going to be reading Wimbley. Oh, Wimbley. Wimbley. Worry. It's hard to say her name, but it's me. But, um, Wimberly worried. And here she looks like she were a lot. Um, if you go on YouTube and see this book and you find out that I have twice, just come down below if, just tell me, um, if you'd like to tell me that, um, I did twice, don't worry. It might be an accident because I didn't collect all the books I or I did. I'm sorry, but I, I forgot. I forgot to do that. So I didn't plan on do it, doing it. So let's try. And that's a kind of worry you might not worry yet. You know, like if you worry about the playground breaking while you're in it, you can worry about that. You can worry about house wrinkling. If it looks a little old, you can. Um, anything kind of like that. Okay, just don't worry about your, like, um, your tissue box breaking, because don't worry about that, it's okay, like, it's not going to break until you actually rip it on purpose or an accident, okay, so you don't have to worry about that, you worry about the other things, for example, okay, so today we're going to be reading Remberly Worried, now I can say it now. So here's Wembley and her bunny. Wembley worry. Wembley worried about everything. Big things. I wanted to make sure you were still here. Mm -hmm. Little things. And things in between. Oh, I think she's worrying about her bunny. Her bunny in that, um, that grip juice or something on. Her, maybe get a stain in between. Mama, what if I shrink? I'm really worried in the morning. Huh. I'm really worried at night. I'm really worried through the day. That shirt and her shirt says, Go with the flow. <laughs> you worry too much, said her mother. You worry. When you worry, I worry, said her father. Worry, 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 said her grandmother. I think that's her grandmother right there. Too much worry. At home, Randy worried about the tree in front of the yard. Because I think she really likes her house that much. She doesn't want to move. Moving is like you move to another house. What if it gets bigger and something comes in with it? And the crack in the living room wall. And the noise. Rat. Red. Raid? Red? Oh, I don't know. <sighs> Maid? What if there's a snake inside? Ooh, snakes. Pretty number for it. You know, frogs. Lizards, I'm okay with. At the playground, I'm really worried about the chains on the swings. 
and the bolts on the slides, and the bars on the jungle gym. That's the jungle gym right there. And always she worried about her doll pedal. I found her, sweetie. Lost forever. She really loves Petal so much. I guess she's her best friend. Don't worry, said her mother. Don't worry, said her father. But one boy worried. She worried and worried and worried. When when Lumberly Lumberly was actually worried, she rumbled. Petal's ears. Lumbly worried that if she didn't stop worrying. Oh yeah. Oh. Petal would have no ears left at all. Mm. Yeah. On her birthday, Lumbly worried that no one would come on on Come to her party. Uh oh. See, said her mother. There was nothing to worry about. So her friends were actually coming out for her birthday party. But then, Wembley worried that there wouldn't be enough cake. This is the best present ever. I wish I had my birthday today. Oh, this is Halloween. It's Halloween now. Look a little here in the Um, on Halloween, Wonderly worried that there would be too many butterflies in the neighborhood parade. Maybe just two butterflies or just one butterfly. I had one. I was Evie, if you don't know she is, she's from Descendants and I was her and I saw another Evie. And she had a different Evie costume, so that's okay. And it was okay for me. Oh, I like some of those. See, said her father, there was nothing to worry about. Then, Wimberly worried because she was the only one. You were too much. Oh, I'm a little. You were too much, said her mother. When you worry, I worry, said her father. Worry, 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 said her grandmother. Too much worry. Soon, Wembley had a new worry school. Wembley worried about the star of school more than anything she had ever worried about before. I worry that I don't get the teacher I want. I'm on the grade I go to, on the grade I go to, I'm uh, 16, my next grade, well, I'm worried that I won't have the teacher I really wanted, you know, like, the best teacher I really want, like, um, so, I'm about to go second grade in August 15th, I'm only in April, so, that's almost May for me, because I think it's the 21st, yeah, I think it's the 21st. Tomorrow's the 22nd, and it's going to be Mother's Day in May, 10th. Um, I loved school, that's what I really said. It's her right there. Oh my, look at this. Look, look at all those worries she had. By the time the first day arrived, Wimberly had a long list of words. Look at all those. Look at all those words. Look at that. 
Look at all those worries. Look at all of them. Look at all of those worries. Those are really a lot of worries. What if no one else was has spots? What if no one else wears stripes? What if no one else wears stripes? Um, I already did that. What if no one else brings a doll? What if the teacher is mean? What if the room smells bad? That's a funny name. What if they make fun of my name? What if I can't find the bathroom? Oh no. What if I can't find the oh. What if I can't the snack? What if I have to cry? That's a lot of worries. Okay, okay we're gonna count. One, two, three. I know. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine worries. Oh my. That is a great lot. Have fun! Don't worry, said her mother. Don't worry, said her father. But Wamba lay worried. She worried and worried and worried. She worried of all the way there. Oh my. All those kids, there's a lot of kids. Then Miss Peach some said, Wembley, there's someone I think you should meet. Oh, I forgot the top. While Wembley's parents talked to the teacher, Miss um, Peach some Wembley looked around the room. I already did that sign, so I forgot to do a talk. Her name was Jewel. Okay, that's her right there, that's Jewel. And then over here we have Wembley. Her name was Jewel. She was standing by herself. She was wearing stripes. She was holding a doll. First, Wembley and Jewel just peeked at each other. This is Pedro, said Wembley. This is Nibbled, said Jewel. This is Nibbled, this is Pedro. Pedro waved Nibbled, waved back. Pedro waved Nibbled, waved back. Hi, said Pedro. Hi, said Nibbled. I rub her ears, said Wembley. I rub her. No, said Jewel. She looks like twins. Like, that should be her sister, because they look like twins, you know? They should be best friends. Look, I like her dress right there. That girl's dress that we don't know. I like her dress. It looks really pretty with all those flowers. Through the morning, Wembley and Jewel sat side by side and played together whenever they could. Pedal and Nibble sat side by side too. Wembley worried, but no more than usual. And sometimes even less. Before Wembley knew it, it was time to go home. Come back tomorrow, call Miss Peach some. As the students walked out the door, Wembley turned and smiled and waved. I will, she said. Don't worry. And that's the end of the book. So what did you learn in this book? What did you learn about worrying? Like, did you learn about worrying? You don't have to worry. Well, one thing you should be learning about in this book is you should only worrying, worry about things that you should actually worry about. Um, and another one is um, don't you should worry like less. You shouldn't worry all the time. You should worry about things that might worry you about and maybe and 
one thing I learned when I worried last, last night. Did you post me? No, not last night. No. Before last night, my last night, um, last, before last night, um, I was, no, last night, sorry, last night, I learned that I was, like, crying, because I was worrying about something, and I learned that maybe you can't stop it quickly, like, you can't stop your worrying quickly, you have to take a while until, like, all the way through the night to the morning, maybe you won't worry then, you know, like, you'll stop, you'll kind of worry about a little bit, but you won't cry, you know, like, something that make you cry, you know, that's what happened, that's what I learned, okay, and in this book, if you have more questions about this book, anything, or you have more things that you learn in this book, comment down below, you can just tell me, and click the like button, subscribe button, so you won't miss any more of these These are very good books. I know they might be long, but long books help you read a lot of words. Um, words that you know, words you don't know, um, anything. Just like chapter books. Like chapter books, like there might be a lot of words that you might not don't know. And maybe a lot of words that you do know, you know? Like, I have a few chapter books, and I have a, a lot of chapter books, but I still have a lot of these books a whole lot and I do have a lot of chapter books you know like I don't have a whole library or something I just have like a lot of books so and I'm up to 17 minutes and I think we're starting to say our goodbyes now and you can learn our next book tomorrow whatever and I'll see you later bye